Hey, Bit Life's back! Woo! It's been a good minute since we played some Bit Life on this channel. What's new? Oh, what is this? The 100 Challenge. There's nothing more attractive than a centurion, cent centenarian, I don't, actually, yeah, I know what that is. With perfect stats. Ooh, I'm perfect. I'm a perfect person, so I'm a perfect person to play the game, because I'm perfect. The requirements, you gotta be 100 years old. Have a bank balance of exactly $100. Oh no. Have 100 happiness, have 100 health, have 100 smarts, have 100 looks. <laughs> did this look at I did this I did this 11 months ago when we did the Squidward I called it the Squidward challenge where we had to be perfect in bit life this is an odd challenge <laughs> smash 100 toes have 100 babies <laughs> come on <laughs> that would be funny <laughs> I'm about to have 100 babies for no reason I'm just gonna do it just to spite you guys that's how good that's how good I am I'm literally a god in this game you know that right a lot of you guys actually pointed out uh, on Twitter that I actually have my own achievement which is really cool where's it at oh there it is <laughs> Watch Beachy Mike on YouTube. That bit boy. Oh, that bit boy. That bit boy. I mean, what can I say? I, I I don't deserve it. Thank you so much. I just needed a small break from bit life, you know? I've been waiting. I've been, you know, I've been scurrying around looking for new things to do. I named him Poop Rack. <laughs> I was born in Maryland, Charleston, United States. I was conceived after my father's condom broke. I'm never, I'm never wanted. No one ever wants me. Why? My father's Dash Ragamel Stripper. My mother's Tisha McCoy, a marriage counselor. We have a dog named Riley. All right, for this challenge, I mean, it, it, it sounds, it sounds challenging. It sounds challenging, but if I've done it before, we can do it again. I feel like living a hundred is going to be, we just got to work out a lot. We have to eat healthy. Actually, you can't even do that in this game, but I, you, have to, you know what I mean. Well, why does why does my dad look like me right now, but with just gray hair? <laughs> See? And what do you know? I'm a male stripper too. <laughs> oh, I wasn't supposed to tell you about my other job. Look, I could use God mode, but I'm not gonna stoop to that level. It'll be too easy. My mother broke up with me. What the heck? <laughs> I mean, my my mother and my father have ended their relationship. Well, he was a stripper and she was a marriage counselor. I, I feel like those two things don't really mesh together very well. So that kind of makes sense that that was just bound to happen. Uh, 100 tears. I'm gonna cry 100 tears for that. Your mother has married your new stepfather, Wade Hooker. Why, wow, she really loves them. them. <laughs> she just knows how to pick them, doesn't she? They went to late Titicaca for their honeymoon. Oh, wow. Wait, her name's Poop Rag. Favorite activity. Okay, uh, so far everything's the same. I always... I always look forward to the new updates of BitLife when new things like happen like randomly. So yeah, I think this is the same thing. We're just gonna draw in circles. I really don't see how that like matters at all. You think we can go to the gym as a toddler? Or uh, actually a baby at this point. Well, we can go to a time machine. Uh, let's just, we're gonna go forward a bunch of years. There's Dwayne Legend. Okay, sure, I'll become friends with him. I really don't see how that matters. Like we do, we do need to be happy though. So it's probably good that we don't get into a relationship because if we do, we'll just be unhappy when they break up with us. I know that sounds very morbid and like, <laughs> <laughs> wow, the playground is actually empty. What will you pick? I'm a monkey bars kind of guy because I'm a monkey. I always got called a monkey when I was little and I actually like had the Chinese year of a monkey too. So it all makes sense. A kid from your neighbor tells you that she received a board game called Sorry as a birthday gift, but confesses that she doesn't really want it. She asks if you would like it. Heck yeah, I don't even know how to play it. I, I never learned how to play that game. Never played it once. Wow, look at those stats. We we're already perfect. I mean, I, I couldn't have started out with a better uh, like stats like when it comes to looks and things like that sure my name's poop rag But I do have the looks kind of awful people would name their son that what the heck I fell out of bed and injured my throat for three days uh, Who would have known that getting out of bed is very dangerous. Don't do it without caution. All right, sure I'll become friends with anyone. I really don't care eyesight your mother's concerned with your eyesight is take your eye Right up. Oh, we've got to do the eye eye test now. Uh What am I looking for? Like it's an E. Is there an E somewhere? Oh, I never, I didn't, I didn't see it. I didn't see it. Well, just like real life, I have glasses. I mean, what the heck? Why not? Eh, those look good. Sure. There we go. All right, we definitely need to study really hard for our smarts if we're gonna get those up. We gotta live all the way. We're only five now, man. I'm so far to go. So I think the challenge is, is that when you hit 100 years old, you have to have exactly a bank account, uh, a bank, a bank account of 100 uh, dollars. 
have 100 happiness. Okay, yeah. Look out, bit world. Uh, I'm going to be the 26,642nd person to have this. And you know what? That's pretty dang close. Have you ever gotten 26,642nd place on anything in your life? No. Dummy? I have pneumonia. All right, I'm gonna be appreciative. We're going to San Francisco for a vacation. Like none of this is it's already irrelevant. All these people are irrelevant. All right, as much as I want to like fight my stepfather and fight everyone, I'm just gonna like be nice. To, I'm just gonna be nice to everyone. I, I don't know. I don't really know what else to do. Wait a minute, did I fall? I fell out of bed. <laughs> I fell out of bed and injured my brain for seven days. There's obviously a tripping hazard outside of my bed. Can we not take care of this? Oh yeah, we also need to go to the doctor. I cannot, I need my health to be really good. Go to the doctor. Yes. Healthy, I'm a healthy boy now. Look at those smarts though. Ah, yes. All right, I just gotta study a lot. I mean, that we should be good. I hope I'm a, a really, um, I also, I also hope we don't get a lot of money because we're gonna have to give it all away. We're gonna have to go with Mr. Beast on this. The heck, evil stepfather. Your stepfather told you that you sing like a girl. The heck, Wade Hooker? What will you do? It doesn't bother me. It's like water under a bridge. I am like zen. So now I gotta go to the mind and body. Gotta read some books, I guess. I don't really care. Harry Potter, whatever. Oh god, why do I have to pick such a big bug? <laughs> I have to manually- I have to manually do this now. <laughs> oh yeah. I really like the book, I guess. <laughs> Oh my god, wow. Reading Harry- Just go- If you're unhappy right now, just go read Harry Potter. That's the answer. Apparently. Because, like, I'm so happy now. It really just made me get over my dead dog. And I think I got a little smarter, too. Oh yeah, we can- Well, we can take a memory test, too. I think I've only done this, like, once. Alright, alright. Simon Says time, I guess. Let's do this. Alright. Ooh. Uh-huh. Yeah. Yeah. Uh-uh. Uh-huh. Uh-uh. did anything I think that was actually a big waste of time and I'm just uh, I just need to keep reading books or something I don't know I'm gonna walk oh what the heck my stepsister got hit by a car while skateboarding oh oh of course oh god we are so unhappy now crap why does the tragic things keep happening all right I'm gonna play sports I, it, it really it, it doesn't matter um ooh, like speech and debate that sounds like something like a smart person would be at so let's do that Ooh, that was successful too. Okay, well, uh, we bust out the Harry Potter again because we are not happy. Let's read the Diary of the Wimpy Kid. <laughs> I never read the books, but I did uh, watch the movie. I heard they just ruined the crap out of those movies. That's all I know. They like changed all the characters, and I just I couldn't watch. I didn't watch anymore. Yeah. Wow. It, it, <laughs> reading books is the key to life. You think our smarts would go up, but I guess it was the Diary of a Wimpy Kid. I don't really think it, it'll make you smarter. Oh, we'll just keep visiting the library. Well, we didn't enjoy it, but it may have made us smarter. Maybe. We need to, like, study harder in school, too. I should have been doing this, man. What the heck is wrong with me? Okay, it's going up. No! No! I will not- Oh, I will be celibate. No, I don't want anyone to break my heart. All right, I'm gonna spend a lot of time at the library. No! Stop, Venus Chapman. Be gone! Fuck! Speech and debate. The sponsored speech and debate of your high school has asked you to become vice president of your team. Sure. And I'll take the driving test. I guess I need a car. <laughs> No cow tipping farmland. Cattle crossing. Yeah. Okay, our looks. Okay, we need to keep going to the gym. We need to go to the gym. We need to do all the things we need to do. Oh, yeah, that got the looks up really, really good. I've been trying to work out more, too. Try to get my looks up, too, because my looks are about a 2% right now. I'm really gonna fix it. God, everyone loves poop rag. That should be a show. Oh, we can go to the salon and spa, huh? And keep getting, like, hairstyles? We just had a cool, <laughs> cool hairstyle. How about no hair? You got your hairstyle at the barber. <laughs> Yeah, they really styled my hair by just chopping it all off. I can get my nails done. Oh, there we go. Oh, I'm broke. Well, I can have money now. I'll just ask my parents for some money. He gave me $16. Is that enough? I don't know. All right, surely that's enough. I have $30. I want to get my nails done. Ooh, looking fancy. Oh, our looks went down. How? Fine, I guess I'm president of the speech and debate. Unfriended. Why? Uh, try to salvage this friendship. 
Oh, I got pranked. Your best friend Cleveland gave you a plate of Oreo cookies after secretly replacing the sweet cream with toothpaste. That's just awful. Or, no, you don't mess with the man's Oreos. Oreos are sacred. They are. My smarts are going up. My other things aren't going up. And I don't- I need to like somehow fix that. What do I do as a guy? I feel like I should probably should have went for a girl because that would have been easier. I feel like you can do a lot more for your looks than a guy can do for their looks. Oh, let's just go on a diet. Oh, I, I really need some money. Evil stepfather, you just received a text from your stepfather telling you that he thinks that you are obtuse. I'm calling an ambulance because he just called me obtuse. All right, I got a part-time job. You know, a little bit of money really would would help with this, especially because if we want to do like some maybe plastic surgery, we're going to need a little bit of cash money uh, on the side. So yeah, I think that's a good idea. All right, never mind. I started a Mediterranean diet. I don't even know what it is, but I did it. So I think it's going to make us more prettier because I really don't know what else to do. I think we just have to keep like, I don't know. I mean, <laughs> this might not be a very fun challenge for you guys because I'm really just going to go through my life, but we'll see what wacky things happen to us. Okay. All right. This has to do it. I'm reading out. Albert Einstein. That has to increase my smarts. The the meaning of relativity. Like, are you? Come on. I'm the fastest tapper. Uh. Oh yeah. Oh my God. Oh. <laughs> Let's go. Let's go. Big brain. Big brain right now. I am so big brain. That was the best that I could have done. Screw, screw you, library. It sucks because I, I needed to go to the library, but I never enjoyed it until I read Einstein. Okay, I'm doing really good though, but we have too much money. New friend. No friends. No. Reject. I didn't know no one in my life. Oh, uh, is that why am I, I'm not happy though? It's probably because I don't have any friends. Crap. I didn't even think of that. Your best friend Cleveland. Oh, so I do have a friend. Uh, is thinking you should get a pet sloth. Or he should get one. Tell him to do it. I just want to see what happens. Okay, we need to quit with the money. I need to quit my part-time job because I don't know if I can give away all my money. Could you imagine that's a problem, having too much money? Existential crisis. NASA's newfound evidence of a possible parallel universe thrusts you into an existential crisis and you begin to question your reality. You decide that understanding your state of existence must be determined now. What are you thinking? My reality is true. I'll never really know. Nothing exists. I live in a simulation. I live in the matrix. That's when you get too big brain. See, my, my theory, and this is what I really, truly, this is, we're going to get serious for just one second. My theory in life is the more you think about things, the unhappier you get. I, that's how I feel right now. I feel like when you contemplate things too much and get all deep in your feelings, like you do understand things, but at the same time, like when you're ignorant and like stupid, it's just more fun. That's what I think. And that's, that's my life lesson. Just be stupid. Oh my God. Some of my friends are eating dog meat. No, that's not, not right. I lost so much money already. What the heck? What if you go in debt? Uh oh. I'm considering dyeing my hair gray to attract more mature women. Okay, bit life. <laughs> I mean, is it the, is it the hair on my face or is it the hair somewhere else? Because we definitely got no hair on our head. Wow, big fail, BitLife. It's always funny going on the BitLife subreddit to see like the bruh moments that, that happened to BitLife. That was one of them, but that was kind of like lame. What the heck? You, you can actually become an angry Karen in BitLife? This was like a month ago. You dress up as an angry Karen and pound a fiercely on your half-sister Elsie's door in an attempt to scare her to death. Unbeknownst to you, she had sold her house to an actual angry Karen who opened the door and screamed at you, scaring you to death. God, bit life. Calm down. Yeah, so right here, so... <laughs> uh, this person's dad had their sister at eight years old. He was only 20 when she had when he had the baby. All right, all right, I'm getting distracted, but crap, that's funny. I want to be an angry Karen. Maybe we need to do that for a challenge. Is that not a challenge? I feel like that should be a challenge, bit life. Please make that a challenge. I'd love to do it. I already have the hairstyle, basically. Oh no, I'm in debt! That is a problem. No, uh, why? Why are we in debt? What, who, do, who do I owe? I don't even live anywhere. Oh, is it because I'm on a diet? I'm on a diet, aren't I? Oh, that's my problem. Yeah, give it up. Give it up. I'm in debt. Now I have to earn some money. I'll be a go-go dancer. I don't care. Oh, they, they don't want me to be that. Ooh, dang. All right, we got that money back. Your best friend Cleveland started a rumor that you you are turned on by the mere sight of Hagrid, the gatekeeper from Harry Potter. Dang it. I told him my darkest secrets. He knew I read Harry Potter. <laughs> didn't, the, didn't the author of Harry Potter say, like, everyone in Harry Potter is, like, secretly gay, but they just didn't say that all of a sudden? Like, I couldn't imagine. Like, I mean, there's nothing wrong, obviously, with being that way. But, like, I just couldn't imagine if the creator of Naruto just came out and said, Oh, well, you know, Naruto's gay. No, he's been with Hinata the entire time, but no, he was never straight. He wanted you, he, he had a shadow clone jutsu and he just loved it too much. Like, I would be devastated just because, like, that's not the character that I grew up with. 
You can't just split flop and change things out of nowhere for no reason. And if you started that way, that'd be totally different. <laughs> it doesn't bother me because it's true. <laughs> Dining with dummies. While walking downtown, you notice that your favorite restaurant has just reopened, but to comply with social distancing, and oh, we got this in here too. The management has placed blow up dolls and mannequins at various tables throughout the dining area. Suddenly, the hostess recognizes you and excitingly insists that you come in for a bite. Table for one, please. Yeah. My favorite restaurant reopened, but due to social distancing, I had to sit next to a poorly dressed mannequin. It was creepy, but the food was delicious. I could see that happening, honestly. Not a bad idea, actually. Wait, what the heck? I've been wondering what the average intelligence level is of people who clap in theaters at the end of a movie. When it's a good movie, you clap! Someone that works in bit life obviously doesn't like that. <laughs> also, I, I, I missed the Tiger King challenge, but like, I, the only reason I wasn't really interested in that is just because I never, um, although I think it was a good idea, like, and when someone mentioned it, I was like, oh, that's perfect for bit, for bit life, but I just never watched Tiger King. But here's the thing, pardon me, a video was released from the legal team of Joe Exotic petitioning a presidential pardon for the self-proclaimed- Oh yeah, I did see that though, like some guy was like talking about it. A friend of yours who was obsessed with Tiger King series is asking if you will help support the worthy cause of releasing Joe from his cage. Re well, I, I don't know, release him, I guess. I, I have no idea. Probably shouldn't say that, I don't know, he may try to sick tigers on everyone. Oh, my father died. This is gonna really affect me. Uh, oh, oh, that's a problem. <laughs> that's a problem. Ah, oh, he gave me a hundred thousand dollars. That's so much more money than I need. Oh God. All right, we're really about to be Mr. Beast up in here. Oh God, now my stepdad died. I didn't even like him. I don't know why it made us sad, but now we're sad. All right, book time. We have to read a really good book to get over this one. Oh my God, my mom died too. Everyone stop dying. Oh, I could taxidermy her and then I'll have all kinds of money. Yeah, let's just do that. Screw what she wanted. <laughs> it actually made me happier to do that for some reason. No, why are my looks going down? All right, I still have too much money. I need like a house or something. I need something to get my money to go down. Oh, I could just gamble. Yeah, screw that. No, but then I'll just get more money. No, oh yeah, oh yeah, I just bought an expensive car. Screw that, good enough. That'll take all my money away. <laughs> Our car's great. All right, okay, I gotta sell that car now. Now I'm not gonna have any money left. I'm gonna give it, oh, I'm just gonna give it to someone. I'm gonna make someone so happy. I'm gonna give it to my nephew. Uh, see, I bet he loved that. It's his payment now. <laughs> That's the thing, people, when you give away cars, the people have to use, they have to pay for insurance and things like that. It could be a real burden to actually give someone a car. That's the one thing you don't realize. It's like, oh man, I wish someone would give me a car. Yeah, like, like a Lamborghini or something? Could you imagine the insurance you would have to pay on a Lamborghini? And not to mention like everything else, like to work on it? My God, you wouldn't want it. <laughs> oh, dang, I got a spray tan. <laughs> I guess that apparently helps your stats a lot. Ow. No, 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 no. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> I got struck by lightning? What? <laughs> and I'm not dead. How? How am I not dead? That is literally the worst thing that could have happened to me right now. Zero stats. Oh my god, this is gonna have to be a come. I'm 65 years old. I'm gonna have to work for this. <laughs> but why did it make me stupid though? I get it. I get the health, I get the happiness, but why am I stupid? My knowledge just got zapped out by the lightning, I guess? Like. That doesn't make any sense. Getting hit by lightning actually took my eyebrows off. I don't have any hair now. I'm even more balder than I used to be. I didn't even know that was possible, but now I now I know. Now I know it is definitely possible. Do not go out near the lightning. I really hope in this self-help book they say what to do when you get hit by a, a lightning strike. I'm pretty sure there's a chapter in there somewhere if I remember correctly. So you got hit by lightning. I am really starting to hate this game right now. I can't I can't believe it. I, I I started out with such good stats. I don't think I could even go back. First of all, I gotta get it up. I'm like 60, I'm over 70. It's just impossible. I have so much money. Oh my god, thank god. My smart my smarts my smarts did go up a lot, so it seems like reading is the best thing to do, so let's just keep doing that. Woo! There we go, boy! Now we see some major plastic surgery and we all oh, good. Okay, where is it? Okay, alright. Base lift, success. Things are looking up, but we have 20, 20 years left to complete this challenge. 
And, you know, as they say, it's not exactly easy as you get older. So, I don't know. I don't know what I'm gonna do. I got fired. I, I got, I got fired. I have 15 years left to do this right. That's fine. 15 years is fine. That's kind of okay, because we needed to get fired anyway. And I have just enough money to probably do another plastic surgery to really get me to that stage. Now, if, if it gets botched, I'm probably gonna quit the game. I tried my best, but I, I, I play, you know what? I'm not afraid to take some, take some risks and I'm going to do it. I'm going to take the risk, the risks, the risks, liposuction, get the surgery. Ow. <laughs> this freaking game hates me. It hates me. I can't, I can't do it. I can't, what am I supposed to do? Sure. I can get like the 50th tan. I'm going to be so dark. But it doesn't matter. It doesn't do anything. I got so ugly for no reason. Oh, I went on a hot Cheetos diet. I didn't do that. When did I do that? No wonder I just got a super fat. This game freaking hates it. Oh my God, my health. I, it's cause I, I didn't mean to go on a hot Cheetos diet. Why is that even an option? Oh my God. Listen guys, I already felt it anyway. Why not? I paid for God mode. I might as well cheat. It doesn't do me any good to not. It's not like I'm gonna retry the challenge or anything. So I, I admit defeat. I admit defeat. I clearly cannot do this in it's eight years. So can I even change my stats? I don't even think I can actually change my stats anyway. Yeah, I can't. I just fell the crap out of it. I was doing so well until I got hit by lightning. And then I apparently went on a hot Cheetos diet. <sighs> well, I guess let's just see how we died now. Cause I, I really can't, I can't do it. I wouldn't have even made it to a <laughs> oh. Forget this game, man. <laughs> Today's scrub of the day goes to number five. 